In recent weeks, there has been a small storm brewing on social media. An atheist activist. Um, look at these. Look at these. They, they're pixelating Sexy Kelly. And yeah, see, it was about me. I'm right here. Right? Um, athe an atheist activist. And ex okay, so they're talking, definitely talking about me. But they're pixelating Sexy Kelly. You guys are Muslims now. Congratulations. <laughs> Hey, Hindus, you became exactly what you hated the most. Oh my god, you guys. You're pixelating Sexy Kelly. You're Daniel Hayraju now. You're the new, you're the new Muslims. Great, great job. Like, you you became exactly the things that you criticize. Guys, these are, this is this Hinduism? This is supposed to be, isn't this supposed to be like the land of the Kama Sutra? I mean, isn't, have you guys went to Cali temples? Their Cali's are naked! My Cali wasn't even goddamn naked! My Cali was not covered! Her nipples weren't showing! If you go to the temples of Cali, she's topless! And they're pixelating this? Are you gonna go, are you guys gonna go pixelate your temples? Like, what the hell is happening? You, you're like, Hinduism was not the sex negative! What the hell is wrong with you guys? You're Muslims now! You are Muslim, like, oh, like, you guys, you know what the interesting is? Like, they, because they think because I'm attacking Hinduism, I must be Muslim. And no matter how many times they tell them, like, no, no, I'm not Muslim. Like, nope, you're Muslim. You're attacking Hinduism. Oh, once a, like, it's in your DNA. They keep telling me, like, oh, you're an ex-Muslim? Well, once a Muslim, always a Muslim. They also tell me, once a jihadi, well, always a jihadi. They keep telling me that, oh, being a Muslim is in your blood. It's in your DNA. I'm like, sure, okay, whatever. Um, like, oh, you want, you're like, you have lust, I, we can see your, oh, your souls, everything is about sex with you, Armin. This is the Islam side of you speaking, like, I'm pretty sure Islam is anti-sex, but okay. Um, I'm pretty sure, like, my sexual liberation and my lack of shame is because I've left Islam, not because I am Muslim. But sure, whatever. And then they, then they do this! And, like, they were telling me that I'm acting like a Muslim. And they, they pixelate Sexy Kelly. I'm like, where have I seen this? This is, this is Muslim behavior. This is like Muslims. This is Islamic. You guys are, yeah. You're a Pakistanizing India. Great job. Pakistanization of India is getting closer and closer. Toro is saying, show a Google image search. Hindu erotic site. What? Toro, thank you so much for the 20 super, 20, I don't know what super chat. Susanna is not here to name the... I don't know how Susanna knows the name of the currencies. But, yeah, 20 Danish something. However, why would I do that, Terrell? You know what happens if I show that on YouTube? This video will get flagged and everything. Now I'm not going to do that. But you guys... Oh, yeah, maybe Terrell is saying to the rest of you to do that. Yes. Guys, go do that. Go Hindu erotic statues. Look for that and tell me... If, if my image, if my sexy Kali is derogatory, then Hinduism is derogatory against Hinduism. Okay? Thank you so much for the super chat. Um, oh, wow. You actually say, is this true? This cannot be true. Is this true? Hindus destroyed their own temples out of shame in the 11th century. They're influenced by Islam. Islam, uh, the, no, the British Empire and the Islamic Empire told them like hey this is bad like oh sex is bad sex is bad sex is bad um nudity is bad be ashamed and they were like oh my god look at their temples this is shameful and they were like i don't know if that actually happened oh the danish crowns danish crowns okay um thank you i keep forgetting that um yeah i was saying i was kind of suggesting you do it but i understand still good that everybody go and google yeah i'm not going to do it but you guys go search for it uh amy was saying a few years ago a gay atheist BGP activist was arrested for calling an Indian temple humble. Okay. Um, anyways, let's continue. Activist, an ex-Muslim, posted derogatory pictures of the goddess Kali on the internet. Hurt by the insult, a minority of Hindus... Hmm. Okay, so I know what he's trying to do now, okay? He's trying to call out... He's saying a minority of Hindus. Why are you saying a minority of Hindus? Technically, it's correct, okay? Um, the avalanche of the Hindus that came after me with like, there are like making mock, make, you know, making pornographic images of my mother and my mother who, who died 
from cancer and like taking the picture of me on top with like with right next to her deathbed with my brother and my dad and using that to make derog derogatory uh vile and pornographic you know photoshops and a whole bunch of other stuff like there was a wave like there was a wave of that that just came at me okay and i just like showed the whole world like look at what they're doing and people were like shocked so you know so that was that but he's saying it's a minority of hindus and he's right because it's a small fraction of hindus in the world that did that because there's a lot of hindus in the world right but he wants to focus on minority because he wants to say that this is not a big deal but it was a big deal enough for somebody like this channel to be like cut it out guys like this is bad right this is this doesn't make us look good right but it's interesting because a lot of the hindus that rightfully point out to me that the i mean i know you saw thousands of people coming at you and doing that but you have to understand that thousands of hindus doing that there there's a billion of us out there so this is like a small tiny tiny fraction of hindus as a whole right yep fair enough that's a good point but you guys do have a problem okay um a small fraction of a huge number is a big number okay that's the law of lo law of large numbers and this is an issue this is a problem you have to deal with because guess what you are the same people that complain about the jihadists right and get the jihadist problem is a problem but guess what the radical jihadists are also a tiny tiny fraction of a large populations of muslims right so a again a tiny a small percentage of a big number could cause a huge problem and again if you guys don't manage your radicals on uh, in india uh, in the bgp party in the hindutva I can tell you that a small percentage of a big number of people could really cause a lot of damage and you know I'm, I'm afraid for India and if you're not afraid for India then you're an idiot um, like, let me see what else do we have here wait did I miss anything in the live chat all right let's continue Oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh, see, majority of Indian Hindus support you heart. My bro. I mean, ah, thank you. I don't know if my, I, I'm pretty sure majority of Indian Hindus don't even know I exist, but I, I, I am so humbled by every single Hindu support that I give. Not even that I know that I, we already get a lot of supports from atheists in India and secularists in India but we appreciate even the hindu support that we get we also appreciate even the hindutva support that we get we have patrons that are hindutva in fact i'm going to bring one of them on again hindutva not just hindu we have hindutva who supports the atheist republic right and i'm very proud of it and i want to keep them as supporters because you know we want a diversity of ideas here on this channel right so again i never i ha show me where however have i ever suggested that this problem that we're sh dealing with, uh, the, the Hindu problem that we're facing, represents all Hindus, or even the majority of Hindus. Never suggested that. Um, yeah, Terrell is saying, by the way, Armin, does it not speak volumes that you cannot show the Hindu erotic statues on YouTube, yet those morons even censored Kali's face? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, okay, let's continue piled on abuse and even resulted to threatening behavior. Yes, thank you for acknowledging that. I mean, you were inaccurate about me saying that I posted anything derogatory, but you are acknowledging that at least there were some Hindus who piled on abuse against me. No, that... Hindus piled on abuse. So, okay. Hold on, wait. Net. Hurt by the insult, a minority of Hindus piled on abuse and even resulted to threatening behavior. Yes, I got threats of beheadings and stuff like that. And people who will find me, who will beat the hell out of me. Can I say that, YouTube? I, I'm not saying, I'm not, okay, I denounce, 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 denounce any violence, okay? I'm not saying that, okay? I, I was a, YouTube gods, YouTube gods, the only gods that we fear here at Atheist Republic are the YouTube gods. 
I wasn't encouraging violence. I was just referring to other people threatening me, okay? YouTube gods? YouTube gods? Guys, do some likes and subscribes. That's the sacrifice that the YouTube gods wants. Even, okay. Many were shocked at the Hindu outrage. Yes, they were. Many were like, what the hell is, oh, look, they're showing Abdullah Samir. Uh, Abdullah Samir is saying, the amount of death threats and personal abuse Armin Navobi got in the last three days from Hindus is more than what he received in the last 15 years of activism against Islam. That is true. That is true. However, I'm not suggesting in any way that uh, going after Hinduism has larger, uh, has larger consequences than going after Islam. Okay? When it comes to online activism and online butthurt, it seems like the Hindus have cornered that market. They have, sup they have passed the Muslims. Only when it comes to online activity, okay? It seems like Hindus have managed to become way more butthurt and reactionary than Muslims online, okay? Only in that category, all right? But when it comes to offline consequences, going after Islam is still way, 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 way more threatening than going after Hinduism, like by a wide margin, okay? Like the chances of you getting executed or hanged or, well, that's the same thing, uh, or somebody like the mob showing off with machetes at your house, um, or anything like that, again, Islam, I mean, gov we have governments that have, like, they have the death penalty for you going after Islam. You know, you have Iran, you have Saudi Arabia, and then you have governments that don't have the death penalty, but then you have the mob to worry about, like in Bangladesh or Pakistan, right? And India is not even near close that, to that level of consequences for going after uh, Hinduism. Not even close. But just in the category of online... Um, but hurt and people are going out and trying to take down your accounts and going after your phone guys I have had people who liked my tweets people who simply liked my tweets in India they went after their families they didn't just go after my family they didn't just go after people who support me they went even after the families of the people who simply liked my tweets that's how bad it got. People were, people were, people in India were going and looking at the tweets that I, they liked on me, and they were trying to unlike it before anybody was seeing it. People who posted tweet, um, posted any support of me, or people who didn't even support, people who didn't even, who even said like, you know what, I don't agree with Armin's post of sexy Kelly, but I don't agree with the abuse that he's getting and the abuse that he and his family is getting online as well. They had to go delete their tweets. Even though they weren't agreeing with my post of Sexy Cali, they had to go retract. They were getting so... They, like, imagine what I was getting if they were being overwhelmed for simply saying, hey, please don't threaten, don't send death threats to Armin. Hey, please don't go after Armin's family. They were, get, they were getting overwhelmed. Yeah, I've never, again, I'm telling you, in the past 15 goddamn years of going after Islam, I've never experienced anything like this. Never. It was like, wow, you guys, you guys, like, seriously, India, you guys, you have a big issue. This is a problem. Like, again, I know it's a minority of Hindus, blah, 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 but this is a problem. This is something you need to figure out how to fix. This is, this is insane. But let's continue. Again, but I, I still acknowledge again. Don't be like, oh, Armin is saying uh, Hindus, uh, Hindus are more dangerous than. No, 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 no. Again, number one, offline consequences, definitely Islam. By a wide margin. By a wide margin. And in response, various spiteful exchanges took place. 